find sine 600 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 600 now you should check 600 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 600 lies between 540 and 720 this is 180 into 3 and this is 180 into 4 between these two numbers 600 lies next now 600 is close to which number this is close to 540 so 600 now should be written as 540 plus 60 so this will become sine in place of this we should write this 540 plus 60 this is your step 1 next sine in place of 540 now we should write 3 into 180 plus 60 next here we have 180 so sine is not going to change it will remain sine and inside we get this angle 60 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 3 and 3 is odd and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have plus that means angle lies in the third quadrant and in the third quadrant sign is negative so we should put negative so negative sine 60 is root 3 by 2 this is our answer